Happening this weekend, the University of Arizona homecoming festivities will get underway with the special ceremony lighting up a mountain. Now, ever since 2008, this special event has been the kickoff to all the homecoming fun, but lighting the A itself goes back well beyond the last 15 years. So, Kega 9's Blake Phillips on the west side is sharing the story behind this beloved tradition. So on homecoming weekend night, it was a Saturday night, 7 o'clock, we lit up that A, and you could not believe how bright it was. In 1967, Sam O'Shaughnessy Stengel made a decision that would lay the foundation of a university tradition. Every fraternity has got a tradition where they make the pledges do something their pledge year. So I decided to take on a pledge project. And I, for some reason, decided that a mountain up there was an interesting place to tackle. Using his construction background, O'Shaughnessy Stengel borrowed and bought equipment to bring their plan to light. And to get that done, I had to borrow 70 concrete stakes. I had to buy 700 feet of electrical wire, 100 sockets that attached to that wire, and then, of course, the light bulbs. The university officially brought back the tradition in 2008 to serve as the kickoff to homecoming week. And while the process to light the A does not include the electrical wire and sockets anymore, the celebration has grown into more than just a university event. It is about tradition. It's about connecting, right? And how do we build that Tucson community? How do we bring them into the university? Um, and one great way is lighting that A, right? Because you can see it from anywhere in Tucson. Mark Acuna has worked at the university for 15 years, and he says that the lighting of the A is not just a university event, but a community event as well. Um, and one of the students talked about being a Tucsonan and growing up here in that lighting of A. Um, and she kind of talked about it as a community event. And I truly believe that it is the way we incorporate the, the Tucson community. Homecoming may not look the same as it did in the 60s, but the legacy of that fraternity project remains today. It's always nice to leave a legacy. It's always nice to have a, a nice reputation of being a doer. But... Uh, it's been a fun ride. Well, the lighting of the A will take place this Sunday at 5 p.m. And there will be a celebration over at the MSA Annex on Avenida del Convento here on the west side of town. For now, reporting on the west side, Blake Phillips, KGUN 9.